All right, everybody, it's James GBA 439 here. We're here for an unboxing. We got a pretty big package, as you guys can see here, and I'm wearing gloves due to quarantining. Got to quarantine the mail. Anyway, so we're gonna open it up, and I think you guys are gonna like what I'm about to open, so. And all the paper on there is to blur out all the personal information, so in case you're wondering, that's why. So, man, this is tough. This box is a little tough, I don't know. I see that's duct tape right there. There we go. Man, this is tough to open. Plus it's hard because I got gloves on. into this part so that way I can open the flap of the box. There we go. So that part's open. Now we're gonna open I gotta cut through this without removing I'm gonna have to take this off camera guys because I Feeling I'm gonna, yeah, exactly. That's what just happened. That's what I was afraid of happening. Was that coming off? But yeah, we'll have it, I'll have it open in no time. Come on, this thing is hard to open. Some more tape on it. Hold on, guys. There we go. Oops. That should be done. All right. Let's bring it back in. Kind of cut the paper a little bit, so that's why I didn't want to take the chance because I do keep all the information private. The seller, I keep private, just so that way. You get, so this, so that way safe for me as well because I'm not giving you guys out any of my personal information. There we go. There's that. But what we got in here is really cool. You guys will want it. Not too hard though. I'm alright though. Just hit, just tapped myself with it. Yeah, I'm fine. That's why you guys gotta be careful. Fortunately, I'm wearing gloves, otherwise, that could have been a little. That could have been worse, so I almost died the night. Alright, anyway. The moment you guys have been waiting for. I'm sorry it took so long to open. It's now four minutes into the video. Alright, let's open it. I kind of did a bad job opening it because I kind of ripped that a bit. I actually might have been like that. I'm not sure. So let's open it up. Look what we got here. We got a firefighter's operating panel. It actually appears to be locked. I don't even know if I'll be able to get in. Because I don't think the seller provided me a key. That might be a fail. But anyway, there it is. Yeah. It actually looks to be locked. How about that? 
buy an elevator part, can't even get into it. Okay, uh, I guess that's gonna be it for the video. So if I can get it open, I'll come back. But that's gonna be it. So thanks for watching. See you guys for more videos. And if I got anything, I'll come back. Goodbye. I'm back, guys. I'm gonna see if I can unscrew it because apparently the screws are not in completely. So hopefully, maybe then I can get the panel open. Because if there's one screw. bottom I should say still got one more and this one that one's the only one that's tight that's the problem, guys. So this one's tight, of course. Of course that one's tight. But hold on. Maybe I can s slide this out of the way. Let's see. No, I just wait to see the cords and stuff. I don't think I'll be able to get it open. But if I had a screwdriver for this. Oh, oh, hold on. It is, it is loose. Okay, we're good. Let's see, maybe I might be able to get it open then. So there's your fire hat there. So this would be the firefighter operating panel. Okay. Oh, oh. There we go. There's the lock. Ah, there we go. Now it's open. So, at least now I know what to do. I don't have a key. So first off, I'm going to screw these back and then we're gonna try out these buttons. But at least I figured out a way to get it open. Hopefully I can get a key so I can actually use that sometime. That would be cool. So I'm just gonna screw these back in. Oh, oh it's the right spot there, it's right there. I'm gonna screw these in not so much so that way I can actually get these open. But this actually looks like a Schindler panel because it's got that stop run switch and the buttons look like the Myconic 10s in the Marriott Marquis uh, in, New in New York, Times Square, New York. But anyway, so there you guys go. You can see it's open. So we're actually going to try out the buttons real quick after I get the screws in. I haven't ever pressed them yet, so this will be the first time. I, I was looking at the screws and I was like, maybe maybe I could get it open if I take out the screws. And sure enough, I was able. So yeah, this is probably my biggest elevator panel I've ever gotten off eBay before. I got it for a very nice price as well. So at least I got it open though. However, I gotta make sure it doesn't close because then I'm gonna have to go back in. But anyway, stop, run. Yeah, these these are, I think are the Mechanic 10. So that's door open. And that's door closed. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> the button is sticky. <laughs> Look at that. So the door close button got stuck. <laughs> you know, we'll experiment a little bit with it. I guess we'll take the screws back out, see if I can get that door close button to pop back out. <laughs> wow, that's, that's kind of funny.